Tyler YouTubers, this is the B Man 610, and this is my new base. So, you guys already saw this in my 350 subscribers mock. I just didn't want to wait any longer for the mock because I've been, you know, that's even though it's only been like three, four days since I got my 350 subs, so I have like 30 more. So, I almost have 400, so that's awesome. But anyway, we'll go over it. Here we have a really nice flower pot, it's pretty cool. We have all oh, this grass and flower. It goes three rows of grass, then a row of flowers, three rows of grass, then rows of flowers. And when you go like this, it looks really, really, really cool. And we have the same back there. And then to get into the base, which, as I said in my mock, this is actually a clone training center, guys. So, yep, that's pretty awesome. It's, you know, where all the new recruits get trained, or it's one of the many places. This is, like, where, you know, all the... This is, like, getting ready for episode 3, the Battle of Sheik. So, we're good, and you got to push that door and all the way so you get in. And you probably can't see this. You might be able to. But right in there, you can see, like, a little hint of green. That's where the second door is, which... Actually, sorry guys, I forgot, I have to show the top part first so I can get into the bottom. So on top we have, what it is, is it's a green base plate and then all this other mini base plates, which I put all my white bricks on, or almost all, and then I have all of these green tiles where we didn't have white bricks to make it look really cool. We have this, which is covering up the uh, stairs. It's also like, you know, like a little hatch. We have a snow trooper climbing up to get some exercise. And we have Lieutenant Dex walking in. We have Shock Trooper Lieutenant, Shock Trooper Commander, Shock Trooper Snow Trooper talking to these six clones, seeing if any of them are worthy to be in the Legion. Shock Trooper Legion. And then my flamethrower Shock Trooper, who's showing off his gun to the two clones. They're like, awesome. And we have Jesse, who's just sitting there. Taking a break, two Senate commandos who helped King set, set them to make sure that, you know, everything's going well. And we have a gun rack right there. And then we have another uh, thing right here to get down into the back part, which that's part of my mock. And then I'll just take the top part off, set it down somewhere. And just the top part alone probably weighs like two to three pounds. And the bottom part probably weighs like five, six Maybe even seven pounds, so it's like seven to ten pounds total. So again, this this is base is on the sheet, guys. Just in case you were wondering, and you didn't see my 357 mark. So anyway, we have this gate all the way along, except for right here, which there's a ladder there, so that works out. And I also didn't have any leftover gate. And then all the way along here, and all the way along the sniping line. And I actually was surprised I had quite a lot of mini base plates in my buckets of uh, Legos, like, from when I was, like, you know, younger. So I didn't actually need to get them from the Lego store, so that's cool. I was able to finish that off. Then to get in, you see right there, there's that, uh, that door. What you do is you just got to slide that. I'll try, I'll, here, I'll prop this down like that. Uh, there we go. Okay, so you just gotta slide it until it goes all the way down. And then you guys, the clones can walk in. As you can see in there, I had to use quite a lot of these green pieces. They're all over the place. We have a clone here who's making sure that only clones can come in. Because no Jedi actually know about this. Because Palpatine doesn't want Jedi to know about this. So this in the end will actually help him execute Order 66 on Kashyyyk and stuff and execute Order 66 all over the planets because, you know, he has and lots of clones here. And then we have another clone right here, which is... Oh, snap. I destroyed the flower bin. Oh, well. I'll just fix that later. Because uh, right here, there's normally, like, clothes when you put the gate, you know, the door in. So he's just in case anyone comes in here. And then the lieutenant arrow walking up here. Which all these green strips are like walkways. So there's a walkway to come in. 
That's a walkway to get to there, another walkway to get to there, another walkway up here. It looks really cool, especially from this angle. It's really cool. And also, I guess you could like put speeders in there. And we have Rex Duck and a nine clones, just telling them, you know, what's here. These are the newest recruits. We have the pilot, the EP3 pilot, talking to two clone pilots. There's a third one in there because they're getting ready to, you know, use the flight simulator. Then we have four clones with Fox telling them about um, the hologram table and how it works. I'll do a tutorial on that in a little bit. After this fit, I mean. And up here, then we have all that railing. All that railing with the uh, mini base plates was four sharpshooters, sharpshooter lieutenant, and two snipers with a sharpshooter commander just walking along, making sure they're doing okay. And then, so that's pretty awesome. Then, right here, we have this ordinary piece of wall, but then if you lift up this ladder, you can just pop it out. It's pretty cool. I just had to take green pieces, put them right down there, then take some white pieces and green pieces and put it up there. So just a sec, so then, when I slide it in, just like so, it fits snugly. That's pretty much it guys, I hope you like this base update, I really really love this base. It's amazing, it's like 250, 300, no it's probably almost 400 2x4 bricks. That's it guys, and bye.